our educators have a way of shaping future minds. They step in when there's a problem, and they try their very best to make our students feel safe at school. Tonight's Pay It Forward is about a principal who's doing just that. Our Joy Wang has her story. Roosevelt Middle School's Principal Nation likes to walk through the halls and check on classes every day. All three of our kids have gone to school there, have all um, at some point or another required um, a principal intervention as far as like bullying or um, just a need to, to talk and discuss problems in classes or things and she's been available for all of them. Not just at school, but outside the classroom too. We've called her on the weekend before for issues related to school, and she's always answered the phone. Hosting school dances so students have a responsible place to have fun. She means everything. She's so caring to me. She made stop bullying happen for especially me. Bullying, a problem very real in our schools, but not after Principal Nation steps in. We sort of need someone to learn by, so she helps us. She teaches us how to do all the stuff right. Which is why the Davis family has nominated her for Pay It Forward. And she never asked for anything else, just for her kindness. She deserves something. Are you ready to pay it forward? Yes. Great. So we have one, two, three, four hundred dollars. Let's go. I'm really excited for her. She really deserves this. How did she change your life? Um, she stopped the bullying that I've been experiencing. Um, she has made the school very safe and comfortable for me. Hi, Principal Nation. I'm Joy with KOV, and Andrew here has something to say to you. Hi, Andrew. Hi. You've changed my life for this whole two years I've been here. I would like to say thank you so much for doing this and for stopping the bullying immediately. <laughs> All right. One. <laughs> One, two, three. Oh, Andrew, you're so wonderful. You're such a sweetie. And I know right where this is going to go for our celebration of the end of testing. So now we can have some really fun games. Uh, Principal Nation, how are you feeling right now? Ah, overwhelmed and excited. Andrew's such a blessing at this school, and I just really enjoy having him here as a student. And the students are what it's all about. So many parents have talked about how you stop bullying, you go to every event at school. Why is it important for you to be such a huge part of their lives? Um, if I'm not making a difference every day, then there's no reason to get out of bed. I, I totally am here. That's why I get up. I love to be with my kids, to spend time. They're my oxygen. Soon, Principal Nation will be retiring, but her message will live on at Roosevelt. We teach our students to be upstanders, not bystanders. So whenever they see that there's something that's not right, that they need to be strong enough to either help that person leave the situation or to tell the person that's bothering them that that's not okay, that we don't treat people like that. We always treat people as we expect to be treated and you're at Roosevelt and you are held to a higher standard than anybody else because you're Roosevelt. Thank you. Oh, absolutely, you're so deserving. Paying it forward. <laughs> I love you and appreciate you so much. Joy Wang, KOB4.